Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and it is Horde Night uh, 105. And we are heading up to the Horde base. Got a couple of quick things we got to do, and uh, then we'll be ready to go. So, um, if you watched the last episode, you will know that we installed um, some. Uh, what are they called? Automated spike traps or something like that. And um, my concern that I have about all of that is whether or not we will be able to. Oh my goodness, we are like massively over encumbered. Okay, so what? Let's put half of that back, some of this back, some of this back. What is so doggone heavy, man? Uh, probably all them shotgun shells <clears throat> are not helping. Any, uh, let's take a steroid. Uh, probably the pipe bombs are pretty darn heavy. Let's put some of those back. Uh, we don't need this. We don't need this. We don't need that or that or that. Uh, 347. Okay, so that gets us in business here. All right, so uh, let's get this started here. And, um, yeah, my concern is I don't know how well the spike traps will hold up um, if a demolisher explodes and if the spike traps will set off the demolisher. So I'm not, <clears throat> I'm not sure how that all is going to work. So... I guess we're going to find out. All right, so this is all the stuff that we have here. Uh, I don't think we really need to have a wiring tool in our inventory. Unless I have to quickly fix something. Uh, we do want some electrical parts for repairing the fences. We have 101 steel plating left over. And um, we really need, probably should... Concrete action there. We probably should um, upgrade these concrete plates too. Yeah, it only takes five steel plating, so let's do it. Okay, that fence should be active. Everything should be active now with that on, uh, with the generator on. One other thing I really should do, though, as I think about it, is I should have probably covered uh, the spike traps with a plate in case they do get destroyed, because then the Zeeks could potentially climb up on each other's shoulders, but that's probably not going to happen. So I, I think we'll be okay. <laughs> Famous last words, right? Okay, let's take on Horde Night 105, ladies and gentlemen, and see how things go. We'll let him get up here. I'm not going to jump over there and try and snipe him because the fence is live. Well, at least I hope it's live. Should be. And so they should be showing up any moment here. Zombos? You are coming, right? They should be here by now. We're getting very close anyway. What the heck's going on? Here. Let's turn this off for a second. Do we have a broken pathway or something? Oh. They're, they're not able to get up here. They're pathing up here, I think, must have... Has it been broken, or what are they doing? 
There's not really any reason for their pathing to be broken because... Oh, no, they're coming. Okay. Wow. That's the longest I've ever seen them take to get up here. All right. Let's see what happens. Those spikes do a pretty decent amount of damage. All right, now, are the spikes going to set the demo off? That's the thing. If we're really careful, we can get right up in his face without hitting his no-no button. And I have a choke on my shotgun, too, so it's pretty, uh... Don't blow up, cop. The spread's not too terribly wide. All right, it doesn't appear like the spikes are setting the demo off. That's good. That's a very good thing. All right, let's take one of these. And do a little bit of explosive action here. Bam, bam. I don't know if the demolisher is still around or not. Let's give him another bam bam. Oh, shit. I heard. Wait a minute, what? I heard them going off. Did the spikes kill him before he had a chance to blow up? Or did he fall off? Why do we have a screamer on Horde Night? What the hell, man? That is against the rules. These zombos need to follow the rules, man. All right, me likey spike traps. Yes, indeed. Look at the screamers. What in the world, man? An irradiated screamer, nonetheless. All right, I want to check the uh, uh, spike traps. Now, that one's got some damage going on, so let's get it repaired. Both of them do, actually. They're doing work, though, man. Okay. Let's do some more Bam Bam here. Okay. Nice. Come here, spider. Another irradiated screamer. What is up with that? All right, let's do a quick repair on the spike traps again. Keep them in good condition. And we'll do a little bit of sledgehammer action now. Let's take some uh, skull crushers. We're in pretty good shape ourselves, health-wise, food-wise, that sort of thing. Come on, Zombos, let's do this. We're kicking the shit out of them, man. Loving these spike traps, dudes. Dudes and dudettes. Okay, um, let's just touch things up. All right, where's everybody at? Come on. Let's do this. We'll touch that up. This is a weird horde night. The horde took a million years to get here. 
and we had a whole bunch of screamers, including irradiated screamers. What is up with that? And now they're not coming. All right, here, let's jump up here. This is so weird. Okay, they're down there. Has their pathway really been broken somehow? There's no reason for them to... Uh, I mean, there's a pathway through the building that they can travel on, but there's no reason for them to damage it because I'm nowhere near there. But that would seem to be what's happening here. Because they're all just kind of congregating down there. I don't think I can get a pipe bomb. Uh, well, here. Will it get all the way down? Yes, it will. All right, um, let's jump up here. That's going to be too far over, I think. Well, I got some of them, though. Okay, well, obviously their pathway has somehow been disrupted, so we're going to have to... See if we can figure out why that happened. So our only option right now is to try and throw some explosives on their head. Um, well, I guess we could also try and um, snipe a little bit. That's too bad, though, really. I mean, <laughs> those spikes were kicking ass and taking names, man. And this is really my only option at this point. I mean, we have a decent amount of pipe bombs, so this sort of kind of works. Twenty-five thousand four hundred XP for that one. That one bounced off the wall there. Yeah, um, when when morning comes, we're gonna have to walk the path and um, see if we can figure out, you know, where the breakdown is, and then <clears throat> reinforce it. This is the you know this is the first time since I've been doing this horde base, which what a, this is like what a, the sixth seventh time we've used this base now, I think something like that. That we have had this kind of an issue. I never really bothered to, to check the, the full path up here because it's never been a problem before. I wonder if the demo that started beeping fell off and blew something up. And Well, no, I don't think that that would be the case because the path's inside the building there. There's a, a demolisher down there. All right, well, we're getting... We're getting some XP for this. <laughs> That's about all we can do right now. You know what we could do is we could go down there because obviously they can't get get to us and see if we can figure out where the, the break is and see if we can do something to fix it so they come back up here. Why don't we do that? Why don't we do that? All right, so what we're going to need to do is uh, turn this off for now. Didn't I just turn you off? There we go. Okay, Roberta, I know this is a really bad idea. I mean, it's a very, very bad idea, but we're going to do it anyway. So let's head on down here. See if we can figure out what the heck's going on, man. couple more explosives. There's a couple of demolishers down there.
Okay, let's walk along here. Now they're supposed to be able to come up this ladder here and through this doorway here. Oh, I think this is, this must be it. So somehow or another they've busted out the stairwell here. Shoot that guy in the no-no button. All right, well, I don't know if I... I don't really have anything on me that can fix this. I mean, I can put some wood blocks down, but who knows how long that's going to last, right? So I guess let's just kind of fight him right here for now. A couple of them will get up. Oh, how did you get over that way, dude? How did he get over that way? I don't know. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, we're just going to have to go along and make sure we reinforce the pathway up here really good. Because, um, like I said, this is the first time we've ever had an issue with this. Okay, let's um, light him up a little bit here. She did? Yep. Okay, good. We got a snow now. I mean, this works. <laughs> it's not according to plan, but it works, right? I think what we need to do is just check this pathway as part of our, you know, Horde Knight preparations moving forward. It probably, you know, took damage over time and just eventually gave out, I'm guessing. This is kind of like, you know, similar to what we had when we were down in the, the garage. It doesn't, it, you know, it doesn't work too bad, really. Think about it. They can occasionally jump up here, but not enough to where we can't handle it when they do, you know. Okay, let's give them a little bit of explosive love here. Ooh, there's a, a gold drop down there. Nice. Spitting copper ruski. Okay, let's try something. I don't know how well this is going to work. Uh, in terms of, you know, how how long those wood blocks will hold up. But let's just see if we can 
get up here and oh shit get out of here you stupid frickin vulture he was pushing me keeping me from getting up the ladder is he gonna get through no okay let's turn on the Jenny All right, Spikes, go to work, man. I think they must have already broken the wood blocks. Let's pick that back up. There's nobody else is coming. <laughs> Probably broke them already. Son of a gun. Okay, let's uh, let's have. A sham chowder for some health. We get 80 health from that, which is pretty good. And uh, let's have a water. And we'll take a big health kit too. Okay. Load everybody back up. And let's grab some more pipe bombs too from here uh, we'll grab a, uh, some more shotgun shells too and we're doing pretty good on everything else I think yeah this isn't exactly what I in, had envisioned for this horde night but you know shit happens right you gotta adjust I'd rather fight him in, in that other building so they're not doing severe damage to our main, you know, our main structure here. Master, we are not alone. Yeah, they broke out that one there. Come on, Zombos. Here, let's see if we can repair these so we don't have to mess with them later. That spider could potentially get up here. No, I couldn't get out of the way. He did. Cop just blew up. buzzard around somewhere. Okay, we probably better take some meds here. Let's take a big medi kit. Machine guns has improved to 35. Nice. Is 
So yeah, I guess we won't be able to fully test our spike traps until next Horde Night now. You did? Yeah, you are now. Some of a bitch has infected me, man. You know what? I don't have any infection stuff on me. I've got antibiotics back at the base, so we'll just have to wait till morning now. time is it? it's 3 30 okay we're getting close Master, we are not alone. no we are not alone Did we get a level? I think we have gotten a level, yeah. We need two points uh, to get the next level of perception. That's what we've been waiting on. Almost morning. Okay, it's morning, so we just have to deal with whoever's left here. damn vulture at. Hey! Get out of here. Off with your head. Did? Yeah, I think so. All right, just a few more. Ah, oh, man. Looks like the gold dropped is despawned. That sucks. Incoming enemies. Prepare for conflict. Okay, here are a few more. guys at. Looks like they might be stuck, you know, down like in the basement area or something. 
All right, he's able to get up here. Let's do a little bit of touch up here. Oh, we got a concussion. All right, here, let's take a pill. I'll fix that. Uh, so the only serious critical we have is an infection, but we, we have plenty of antibiotics back at the base to take care of. Oh, the gold one actually still is down there. Okay. All right, I think we've pretty much cleaned the majority of it up. I, I still hear one or two Zekers, but let's jump on down here and do a little bit of touch up here because this is the part that we got to repair. Master, we are not alone. And if I have the resources, I'll uh, probably upgrade these stairs to steel too because this is a critical pathway here for them to get up to the main base there. Okay. All right, let's pop um oh shit. You know what? I forgot to put <laughs> I forgot to put my luckies on. Damn it. Or, I mean my uh uh nerdy glasses on. Uh, whatever. Okay. Let's just take that. And let's also we got two points, so we want to put the next point into perception. So we got that done. All right, let's see what we get for Lutskis. And we've seen that stuff many times before. Uh, I want to check this gold one. Oh, shit. Don't be stinking up on me like that. It's rude. All right, what do we got in the gold? Really? That's it? Oh, come on, man. What the hell? What's the point in having super rare gold drops? That's like the only the second one I've seen in this entire playthrough. Just to have shit loot in it. What in the hell is up with that? Subquake, I don't I don't know if you watch my videos, but if you are, come on, dude. I love you, man. You got the best mod out there. But what the hell? <laughs> You're gonna have a gold drop. It only happens it. like once every tiny blue moon. Where the hell do these guys all come from? You should guarantee that it has some good shit in it, man. Just saying. Will you die, please? You too. Go down and stay down. Ah, okay. Where the hell did they come from? They must have come up from the mine. This is this was my original mine down here. Okay. Well, um that was not quite the horde night that I was expecting to have. But we didn't die. <laughs> So there's that, right? We didn't die. So what we need to do, like I have said a couple times now, is we've we've got to get um, we got to get the stuff reinforced here. Um, going up to through here. So this is all got to get repaired and upgraded. Oh shit! And reinforced. Where's he at? Where did you come from? And we never unlocked that ATM. Yeah, so this pathway here is the critical path. So we got to get it reinforced, upgraded, and probably upgraded to steel at least. Or at the very least, I mean, uh, well, concrete's concrete's fine, but I just need to check it. You know, be as part of, like I said, our horde preps. So it's just in, in good shape. Because there really isn't any reason for them to be damaging this, because I'm nowhere near it normally. But obviously, over time, they have, you know, they have damaged it. So we got to give it a little bit of attention. <sighs> okay, well, like I said, the important thing is we survived the Horde Knight. Just not the Horde Knight we were expecting is all. So I am going to do some repairing here, get this fixed all back up, and ready for... 
you know, the next horde. Um, here, you know what? We might as well unlock these things, right? Especially since I still have a, a few minutes on um, eye candy. I don't know if that actually applies to this or not. Let's unlock these. Because this is a, actually a bank POI. It looks like it's going to be on this side. There we go. $287, make it holla. Okay, let's check these. $238, make it holla. Okay, that's right about in here. A little bit further down. 185 bucks. Come on, man. After all that, oh, we never hit this bookshelf. Uh, we got a few drops out here. That's somewhat decent. Blue drop. With the same old shit in it that all the other drops seem to always have. Okay, I guess that's it. I guess that's it. So, yeah, a little bit, uh, uh, what's the word for it? I don't know. It was, it was a little anticlimactic, I suppose. I would have liked to have seen how the spike traps held up, you know, throughout the whole night. I mean, they, they pack a punch. They really do. Uh, but they also, you know, took damage fairly quickly too, from what I was able to see. So, you know, if we're going to rely on them, we're going to have to really make sure we, you know, keep on top of things in terms of, you know, keeping them repaired and stuff. But there's no major damage here, really. I'm not really too worried about much of any of this. Um, but we definitely got to make sure, like I said, that we keep the pathway up to the Horde base, you know, coming through here uh, in good condition. Because that's critical to, you know, everything else working. So I'm going to work on this, get this all fixed back up. And then I'm probably going to take a day or two, an in-game day or two, just mining like crazy and getting a shit ton of resources so that we can get back to working on, um, you know, uh, getting the Deshong Tower upgraded and some of the other things that we need to do. Oh, and, and getting the elevators made. Yeah, we got to get elevators made so that we can update to the new version. Uh, so that is the plan. Guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.